So team, keep it clean. Big announcement coming from our Baltimore Ravens that our guy T Sizzle, Terrell Suggs, that they are going to be inducting him in the Ring of Honor. And see, when the time comes, I would expect him to definitely be a Hall of Famer. But the Baltimore Ravens, they're like, no, 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 we're not waiting on that. We're going to put you in our own personal Hall of Fame. And it wasn't until I watched the video that they put out on this where I realized just how many people, well, really how little people are in their ring of honor. Uh, because I believe Ozzie Newsom said that Terrell Suggs will be the 14th person inducted into uh, their ring of honor. So... That's something special. That's something really special. You got to be an extremely special player to get into that because obviously, like, players come and go with not just the Baltimore Ravens but just with any organization. But tons of players come and go literally every season. So for you to be a select chosen few amount of people that make it into the ring of honor by a team, that says a lot about who you are, what you did on the field, and everything that you accomplished and what you meant to that football team. So with Terrell Suggs, oh, we already know. We already know. I mean, we could read off some of the accolades, but they don't tell the whole story. They tell a lot of the story, but they don't even tell the whole story. Like, look at this. NFL Defensive Player of the Year in 2011. Uh, NFL Defensive Rookie of the Year in 2003. Seven-time Pro Bowler. Like, the, the, the man got so many different accolades, and I think he, he got the record, and he would always gladly let him know uh, that he sacked Ben Roethlisberger the most times and whatnot. And, and what did he say about Ben Roethlisberger? He said uh, something about his, his, his behind belonging to Terrell Suggs. I forgot what the other part of it was. But anyway, we know Terrell Suggs was like that. And if you had the privilege to ever watch Terrell Suggs play, like looking at highlights, like they, they do it a lot of justice. But when you actually were watching the game live when it was happening, it was just different, man. It was, it was so different because you just knew, like, Ravens had Hall of Fame talent. They had elite talent on every single level of their defense. And Terrell Suggs was a huge part of that. An outside linebacker, Terrell Suggs on the defensive line, Lodi Nada for a good amount of time. And, and a lot of other guys, too. Obviously, inside linebacker Ray Lewis and in the secondary, Air Reed. And that was just, they were amazing, man. They. <laughs> It was so crazy to watch, man, because that's when we would get more excited for the defense than we would the offense. Because the offense was like, ah, but the defense was like, yeah. But Terrell Suggs specifically um, just made a countless amount of plays. Again, as a pass rusher, as a run stopper, uh, as reading screens and stopping them, I'm sure a lot of our favorite Terrell Suggs interception was probably the one where you could tell he worked on the thigh master uh, where it was against the Pittsburgh Steelers. And Roethlisberger, I think he tried to throw it in the flats. He tried to throw a screen and throw it in the flats. One of the two. Terrell Suggs, like, tipped it up and caught it, but he caught it with, a, with, a, with his thighs. He caught it with his thighs. And it did not touch the ground. So he made that play happen. And it's a countless amount of other plays that he made throughout the years. For the Baltimore Ravens And then he and he won a Super Bowl too Won a Super Bowl Was part of the Super Bowl team in 2012 And then Remember that Some years later He went off to another team And won a Super Bowl with them too But we ain't worried about that But with the Baltimore Ravens He was just such a big part Of everything That they did And all of their success uh, While he was a member of the team um, With Terrell Suggs I remember uh, just the Super Bowl year um, When he got hurt he got hurt, and they said he got hurt playing basketball. He said he ain't get hurt playing basketball, but hey, it is what it is. And and then um he came back. I think he came back against the Texans. I remember being so hype. Oh, Terrell Suggs is back. Let's go. Then we got whooped. <laughs> Ravens got whooped in that game like bad. Um, but. Throughout that year um, And so many other years I always say this about Terrell Suggs He got so many people paid He got so many people opposite him paid Of course you can say the same about Ray Lewis um, But Terrell Suggs got a lot of guys paid Like Paul Kruger Remember Paul Kruger Remember um, Art Jones uh, Helps Darius Smith get that bread and Just a lot of other people too But that's, that says a lot about Terrell Suggs and the type of player that he was and all the attention that he drew and how he opened it up for the people around him. So him getting inducted into the ring of honor, 
it's obviously no surprise. Um, it's something that he deserves. Now, some of y'all will be seeing this live, seeing him get inducted to the Ring of Honor live because it's going to be happening uh, on, let me see that date. This is when, when the Ravens play the Detroit Lions. So that date is on October 22nd at M&T Bank Stadium. So that would be nice. The Ravens, hopefully they beating up on the Lions at that point. And then Terrell Suggs get in, inducted into the Ring of Honor. Then in the second half, they come out firing even hotter than they were in the first half. That would be a great way. And you know what they should do? What the Ravens should do that game? And it ain't even it ain't got nothing to do with the Lions. It ain't nothing personal. But they should, they should score 55 points. They should go for 55 points in that game. Just to give Terrell Suggs a nice little shout out. But we'll see how it goes Anyway, team, keep it clean Hey, I love y'all, I appreciate y'all Shout out to Terrell Suggs And like I said, hey, if you got to watch him live Then you know what it is uh, And if you never got to watch him before Which, that's fine Watch highlights don't, You know what, don't even watch highlights look, look up full games Look up full games And you can find them on YouTube You can find them anyway But look up full games when Terrell Suggs was playing And just watch his consistent impact And it, it you just appreciate it, man Cause the man, he was a baller, man. He was a baller, and I think to see his best impact, probably watch some Ravens and Steelers game. Make sure it's Ravens Steelers game where Ben Roethlisberger was playing too, and watch Terrell Suggs impact. But anyway, I love y'all. I appreciate y'all so much. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Like I always say, turn the notifications on so YouTube can tap you on the shoulder when we upload and say, "Hey, what's up, big head? You just uploaded a video. Think you think so? Come through and watch. Whether we upload a video, whether we upload shorts. I know y'all don't seen a million shorts today." But, hey, it's all part of the process. I love y'all. Make sure you leave a like on the video if you like what you saw. Hopefully you did. So YouTube can not only continue to notify you, but they can tell other people too. So they can come join us and we can all celebrate together. I hope y'all having a really good day. I'm having a great one. Later on today, one more quick announcement. Uh, with the media, after practice, uh, John Harbaugh is going to speak to the media. But so is Jadavian Clowney. Funny how the timing of that video this morning worked out, huh? Drop a Jadavian Clowney video this morning that we actually recorded yesterday. We didn't drop it yesterday. We dropped it today. And now Jadavian Clowney speaking to the media. NFL outsider, no plugs, no sources, no connects, no contacts, no nothing. We out.